this video, I'm going to show you how to add a quiz on Wix. And a quiz actually can be very advanced and can be also very simple. On Wix, we also have the template for it. But the only thing is a little bit tricky now because they don't have the automatic calculation and showing the results. So that means um, you have to like uh, if you use the VIX quiz, you just need a simple version, but you can see the results and you can, after seeing the result, you send the customers a kind of a confirmation email about the result, everything. But if you want to have a very advanced one, for example, they, they go to see the result directly and uh, for example like the personal personalized and see what kind of person they are, explain why and what. In that way, uh, there is a uh, there are quite a lot of actually different uh, third-party quiz uh, platform you can use. So now I just quickly show you a uh, simple version and then I show you the advanced version like I'm, uh, I know and I'm familiar with but you can also Google some other platform if you want also. So if you want just a simple version you can also this is just a template on Wix so you can just go to the ad here and there is called a contact form and then you see you cannot see the quiz here um, but you can, if you click the contest here if this is a contest this is called a quiz and you can add on it since usual quiz takes a lot of space so I do have the settings here first uh, manage the pages and add empty page here so in this way I have uh, uh, a single page for quiz itself. So for example, this one. And then I just do the um, contacts and forms, contacts here, and then here you see the quiz. There are two styles you can choose from. So I can just take this one just to do example. So now it looks like this. Take your quiz and this is as normal as other Wix forms. You can just click on it, add it on it, change the name. Everything is like this. And the only thing more advanced one is this one, the choices here. So if you want to change the title, you do the edit field, you change the title. See, this is the default default selection. That means uh, you have you are going to have like a, a settings like which one default. But you if you don't do it, then it just don't show it. So people don't know which one's the default one. I think it's good if you don't want people to know the answer. Okay. So when you're showing like this, and then you do the choices, like this is the three choices, you can have more choices if you want, have the, as many as you want, and then you can just duplicate and then change the name here. I have the edit label here, change name, um, blue, something like that. And then Mm, um, so the thing here you need to pay attention is that uh, um, this also you can set up default and then you can also delete one you don't want so it's um, very flexible for you to do it okay and then you go to the settings and uh, then you see make sure everything is correct and then that is this if this field is uh, required you click here if not so that's okay if you're optional for people okay and user quiz you can't be required. So this is a basic setting for, for your forms, make it for your choices. And then if you want to add more, you can do just click the whole whole uh, VIX forms, you add new field, and then you have the mm, contact forms, all the uh, contact information, and you have basic forms like radio button. This is the radio button field, okay? You can just drag one to here, and then that's Done. and you have several other uh, options and um, well, the once the one if uh, you have updated uh, the new version like uh, they have the once the uh, field you can do that but uh, now I think it's enough just for quiz for the basic field okay so I just show you how it look like I just radio field you can just add here and you can show like this right as you can see these are the choices the same uh, uh, way to do the addition for this one Okay, remove this one and uh, and um, 
do things, and then if you want to do the uh after people submit answers, where do you want to get people to? And you can do either just success message or go to the page you want. You add a link here or uh, external URL things, and show the link to the file, the file downloads. And um, after you done this one, we can just do a success message here. But if you want to do add, then you can go here and choose your. Uh, pages, for example, you want to go to them. The yeah, we can do an at this portfolio page. Then it's done. Okay, so, and then we can publish it. And go to the C, and then you see how it looked like in the in a real place. Oh, the way we didn't show it on the manual, so we need to go back. To, and this page is called new page. Let's change the name into the quiz. Okay, and then we do here the menus here, and we add a menu here called quiz. Here. Okay, so now we have the quiz here. Now we publish this one, and then we see the pages here, and we see the quiz here. Okay, then we can do a uh. Test on here, and then we show you how where you can see the result, and we can just random choose because this is has been set as default. So we we if you do it, it's better not set the default as I did for the settings. Okay, then and submit the answers here, and then see if you opt if you want to link to your uh. Offer page, you can just link to here. You see the and this is just the home page for it. Okay, after you fill in this one, then you go back to the uh, Wix. This is has been saved and go to here. And this is the page. Okay, this is the page, and then you go to the uh, customer management, and then there's you can just click on this one, and then there's called a form submission. And see here has a quiz. You go to the quiz, and see this is the information I have like Dongjo Carson, my email and address, and uh, this is my answers. You can see here, right? And uh, this one, the unfortunately on Wix they don't uh, calculate the result. So you, if you don't have many customers to take care, you can do like this. You say, okay, this is answers here. Uh, what kind of person is it, and uh, maybe what kind of package is suitable for this person? So you can send a uh, like a package for them. It's for like a uh, uh, an email for them, and uh, so this is, has to be done by yourself. And then another thing,、uh, another、uh, third-party、uh, platform is this one. I'm going to show you. Is called I think it's called in, yeah this one. I think I have opened it. It's called Interact, which is the the one has.、Uh, um, I can send you、uh, put the link here also to for you to find where it is and、um, how to connect.、Uh, The form to Wix. They, I think, I found the blog. Yeah, here. So they have some information how to put the code, how the guideline, how to put codes on Wix. And this platform is quite advanced. You can,、um, I think,、uh, if you don't have so many customers, you can use the free account, like、uh, account, since、uh, the. They have、uh, the free one. They don't have the lead magnets or add、uh, people to your email list, but、uh, they don't have any influence on their、uh, content, their、uh, quiz. So that means you can do as many quiz as you want, and you can do、uh, like as many like、uh, different forms as you want. So this is, the function does not influence, but they just don't add your people. Uh, directly to the email, directly to your list, but uh, uh, for your purpose to you know to after people fill in get result and then they will、uh, click the link to see、uh, the products you offer like means the call to action that they can all, all、um, they can all do. Okay, so that means、um, I can show you、uh, the free version here. He has a free version here. 
And this is just uh, uh, very simple to add. This is just cover, like a uh, introduction. Just all of these things are able to just click and write. So it's uh, very, uh, very simple to handle. What is your, um, yeah. So it, we, can, we can also just write quiz here, something like that. And then if you have a, a picture, you can click and uh, and upload replace the image okay and uh, yes something like that from your from your own computer okay find the image and or upload from your computer okay upload and uh, or and then you can add the text and take quiz and all the questions here like the first questions like this you can add and answers this and you can add answers also like this so all of these templates already have here and then if you have the like of course they have other um, other template also but uh, that's just example c and this is all the questions uh, this, for example the first question like this and then you need to like uh, do the settings of scores here see here, here if you do if they answer this one you got this score if they answer this one got this score if answer this one got this score and then save it so the same as other questions okay and then if you go to the results uh, you can see the each of these for example if your scored like a zero to nine and this is you will get this email and things and then the thing i mentioned is that call to action here you can add the url of the offers you have for example if you want to become better or which or uh, you're going to go to and uh, this answer for example if these the people who are, are kind of maybe uh, need more like a uh, honey product something like that and then you put url which is suitable for their need for example if they um uh, they have very little knowledge about it and then if they have uh, and, and then they have big family how much uh, uh, like uh, honey products they're going to order or something like that then you can just put the link from your website here and save it and then call to action and it finished okay so all of these all of these texts are able to uh, uh, to click and uh, for example I, c I can just you can you can add whatever you want right and then i just uh, sorry i just want to show you if you want to have like for example if you want to link to this one yeah link this text to your offer also you can also link text and save it so all of these text uh, pictures are going to able to link and all the text are able to change and pictures okay and uh, after all this, uh, so then you have like, for example, you have first result and then second result 10 to 19 or third result 20 to 29. And then after this one, you will see here, this is called lead magnet. If you want to enable this one, you have to upgrade your account to the paid one. Um, but this one is just collect the emails. And uh, if you don't want to do it, that is fine. So it's... Uh, that's it. And then if you want people to share on Facebook, Twitter, you'll do it. If you don't want to click this one, don't share it. Okay. So that is basic uh, how, how it looks like. And after you save this one, you will see this have um, this quiz has uh, uh, share and invite. And here, if you want to do it, if you want to add it on the, um, uh, we can publish first. Add it to your uh, Wix. You go here, embed code. You go here. It has copied the code here. Okay, copy the code, and you go back to the Wix, and we can like uh, just just show example. And you go here, add, and then there is called uh, embed code. We can do this one. I think. So add the code here. Apply. And now you see this is going to show up. This is the one we made in this one. Okay, then you can just uh, preview it. Yeah. Okay, so then you can take the quiz here and take this going for a copy and uh, grab this one, this one. Okay, and then 
And the second one, so that the, the thing we can do is make this one bigger, since it's um, easier for people to read. And or uh, at least we can like do a little bit bigger uh, window at the beginning also. So for example, we do we go to here. Make this one a little bit bigger, so you can see. Okay. And this one. So, okay. And if we add a picture, I think it will be nicer. But anyway, like you know how to how it works now. Okay. So in this way, we can just click. Mm. Then pick quiz, and then this looks as a window here, and this one. And page two and page three and just I just choose randomly for five. This is a template. You know you have you can you can delete and uh, add and man as you want something like that. Okay, so then your scores is uh, this score emotion tag is a full flower something like that. You have the link everything and you can have a share it and we since we didn't add any call to action so we don't have it. But if you took Added and you will have the buttons and you will have this uh, uh, text people can click to. Okay, so that is all. Hopefully, it can help you to set up the quiz on this. Okay, thank you.